What's up guys, it's the real Bender here. I'm gonna talk about this new Justice League trailer description that has come out. And now usually for what from my experience these trailer descriptions like usually before a trailer drops, usually usually for what I've seen that usually don't come out to be true. But if it has, let me know in the comment section below. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it has done it before. But yeah, I always wanted to talk about it because it seems interesting. I'll, I'll read it right here. The preview starts with the same footage of Batman recruiting Flash, then logos, including the new DC logo. We cut to a montage of the team, Bruce talking to Dinah at some kind of museum, Cyborg looking depressed as he walks down through, through the hall of a high school. Apparently we see him use some kind of holographic projection to blend in. His voice over from Victor saying, I never asked for this, I didn't want to be something. We didn't see Aquaman and Atlantis, apparently resembles Castle Ruins. Talking with Vocal about his destiny as the Willem Dafoe plays. We see a mother box man guarded by Analytian soldiers when out of nowhere there's an attack. Steppenwolf takes the mother box. Aquaman swims after him. Steppenwolf throws his axe at Aquaman and in slow motion Arthur dodges it. We cut to Batman, Wonder Woman, Flash, and Cyborg being overwhelmed by parademons in some kind of tunnel. A tunnel floods and Aquaman shows up to save the team. We get the dress like a back I did then. Aquaman asks Batman for help. We cut to the team entering the back cave that Splash geeks out. Voice over from Batman about the parademons refer to them as creatures. Kidnapping scientists, W I mean what Wonder Woman asks what what's the plan that Splash asks Alfred for some service after it walks off. Montage of action, slow mo shadow one one falling while trying to reach her sword that Splash tips it with his finger so she can grab it. Cyborg punches Aquaman as Aquaman throws him against the wall as the shot transitions transitions into Aquaman throwing Bruce against the wall. Aquaman, Wonder Woman, and Flash guarding what appears to be the scout ship. Batman gliding into a paradigm and stepping with stepping on Wonder Woman's chest, Cyborg standing on the football field. Flash then makes a joke about Cyborg looking like the Tin Man. After the jail Justice League title card, we get the money shot. Batman is driving towards some type of kind of ship with Superman in the black suit, beard, and mullet. Lands it right in front of a red eyes and evil smirk. While Batman has a look of old shit as the trailer ends. So, usually from my experience, this, this uh, these trailer descriptions don't turn out to be true, but let's just act like it is for the sake of this video. I mean, it looks, it sounds cool. I mean, you uh, you see at the end they reveal the the Superman in the black suit. They that they reveal that he's still alive. Um, what, what makes it at least for me, what makes me think this is a real is that part. It just it just doesn't seem like they reveal that. I mean, we know Superman's gonna be in the movie, but I just don't think we reveal that until the movie because. It's just they've just been so keen on not having him in the marketing. It just seems weird. It's just now all of a sudden just decided to put him in there. Uh, so it's just yeah. Uh, what about you guys? How do you guys feel about this trailer description? Do you guys think it's real or not? Uh, let me know in the comment section below. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace.